Yo, it's Ivor. I started filming a video this weekend about how I find balance between my training, my life, my work, and everything that I do, and it occurred to me that it probably isn't a one video kind of thing, so I thought, let's do a daily vlog series where I take you through a week and show you how things work at my house. But first... Much better. All right, now that caffeination has begun, it's Monday, it's a rest day for me. It's also soccer day for my two older kids. My wife and I split up who picks up the kids from school. She picks them up twice a week, I pick them up three days a week. Today's one of her days. They will take the bus from their campus to her campus and then she brings them home and then we all go over to their soccer practice together. Anyway, I don't have a bike ride today, but it doesn't mean I can just sit here doing nothing. So it is 20 past seven in the morning and I really need to get my day started. So let's get going. We've got a lot to talk about and I've got a lot to do today, so let's walk and talk. I've got a lot going on and it's not always easy to fit all the pieces to the jigsaw puzzle that make up my day. Let's take a look at my training count. My training is comprised of work both on the bike and off the bike in the gym. Mondays I take completely off, that is no riding, no lifting, and I try to do what I can to rest and recover. Said the guy out for a three and a half mile walk with his dog. Fridays are either off or really easy, that is a one hour max ride where I'm not doing any kind of effort. And then I've got five days where I'm actually putting power through the pedals either at endurance pace or higher. And three of those days I also have a gym workout. All right, I'm back from the dog walk and I've got a pretty busy schedule today. I've got a lot of work I have to catch up on, meetings most in the morning, then one in the afternoon. I've got to try to make dinner early today because the two older kids have soccer practice and we're there from five until their bedtime basically. And we are still in the process of trying to purge a bunch of stuff that we don't want anymore. So I need to get some more things listed for sale or get them ready for donation. And also I just realized I really need to shave. We'll see how much of that I get to. That means multitasking whenever it's possible or appropriate. For example, this guy needs a walk every day. He's got a ton of energy and if we don't direct that energy toward productive outlets, he will find other outlets. But he doesn't care if he doesn't have my undivided attention. So I can use these walks to do things like check and respond to emails or make a YouTube video. Or I'll pop on my headphones and catch up on some phone calls. Sidebar, these headphones amplify the ambient sound and send it to my ears along with the phone audio so I can hear very clearly what's going on around me. Please don't be that person walking or riding around with noise canceling headphones oblivious to the outside world. Where was I? Right, phone calls. I know what I said earlier, but there is a time and a place for it. When I'm out and about, it's a great opportunity for me to to call my wife and have her use her noise canceling headphones so we can actually have an intelligent and more importantly intelligible conversation. And if you're wondering why I need to talk to my wife on the phone with her in noise canceling headphones. There are only so many hours in a day, so sometimes I need to cut corners, but food is one of the areas where I really try hard not to do that. I love to cook and food is just super important in terms of your long-term health, and I wanna give my family the best food that I can make. My wife's been asking for a veggie soup, which is pretty convenient because I can just get it going on the stove top and just kinda of let it go all day while I do other things. It's only just after eight, but my day is over. I have to be up at four tomorrow to take a train to Davis to pick up my RV, but that's another story for another vlog. Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. This is why you're on this channel, right? This is good content.